All right, thanks so much for that, Victor. Well, this morning we are joined by Michael Maxwell from the Sioux City Public Library. So right now they currently have their summer reading program going on for both kids and adults. So we're going to be looking at some of the books on the library's adult summer reading list. So what are some of the titles that sure. people are hoping to read this well, summer? Well, first of all, thank you for having me. I'm so excited to be here and share some of these amazing books from our adult summer reading list. I've brought three with me today. Perfect. The first one I wanted to share is called Paradise Falls and it's by Keith O'Brien. This is one that I specifically brought today because I think folks who, who like to tune into the news and stay informed will really enjoy this one because it's such a rip from the headlines. True story. I also think this one will appeal to fans of true crime. Um, it's all about the Love Canal environmental catastrophe that happened up in Niagara Falls in New York and it's there's a lot of tragedy, but also a lot of inspiration to draw from this because the community really bands together and kind of stands up for themselves and they learn how to solve this issue. It's just a bunch of moms who were kind of thrown into the situation. So yeah. it's a really amazing story and that's Paradise Falls by yeah. Keith O'Brien. It's perfect for our newsies. I know I was kind of thinking the same. Yeah. It's beautifully told, but it's a true story. Mm -hmm. So that's uh, that's definitely going to be appreciated for some of our viewers because I know that's definitely the interest here. For sure. But there's another book coming up uh, that you want to be talking about, which was The Invisible Kingdom. Yeah, I have that one here with me today as well. So this is The Invisible Kingdom, Reimagining Chronic Illness by Megan O'Rourke. And this one, it's a memoir about this woman's kind of odyssey through the healthcare system. Basically, something's going wrong with her body and she doesn't really know what's happening. And so she seeks out all these doctors and practitioners and really learns how to become a health advocate for herself, which is such an invaluable skill. Mm -hmm. So I think folks who like to read about health and wellness, people who are attracted to like personal memoirs will really enjoy this one. And there's some procedures she goes through that kind of made my jaw drop. It's it's a wild read. That's always, yeah, that's always good when you got a book that's a page turner that you mm -hmm. want to dive into. And it's also comforting for those, you know, yeah. who may be experiencing something with that. Absolutely. I learned a lot and I think it's one of those books that really kind of works out your compassion and empathy muscles. Mm -hmm. Are there any other reads that we're going to be talking about today. I know you guys have a lot of books coming up yes. this at the library. So, and there's more information of where they can find. Absolutely. On the Sioux City Public Library's website, we have all that information. The last book I was going to share today is It Can't Happen Here by Sinclair Lewis. And I always put a classic on the summer reading list, and this is this year's. It's been a runaway success with our patrons. And so I think if people who like Louise Penny and Vince Flynn political thrillers will really be drawn to this one. Wow, yeah, these are all such great books. They're all different, too. Kind of different genres. Yeah, a book for every something. reader. Exactly. Something for everybody, for sure. And if it maybe doesn't even interest you there, there's, of course, plenty of books that you guys have over there. Yes. You would mention your website. It's SiouxCityLibrary.org slash Adult Summer Reading. Correct. And at that website, you can find a PDF file for our summer reading brochure. You can also find this at any of our library locations. And this brochure will give you all the information you need to sign up for summer reading. And it also has the full book list, which is 12 books long. So, like you were saying, there's a book for everybody on there. Awesome. That's awesome to see. Yeah, summer reading. I know we're kind of pushing that for kids, especially when they're going back to school, sure. you know. So also, when you're an adult, you also need to stay, you know, on your reading. Yeah. Great books coming up, so. And the grand prize is a staycation at the Warrior, so that's some wow. good motivation to get reading. I yeah, think. seriously, there's an incentive for you. All right, well, thanks so much for joining us this morning. Thank uh, we, you. Uh, we hope to talk to you uh, coming up about more books.